Hello, Chaos Coordinators, and welcome to Coordinate Your Chaos with the Blended Mama. I'm excited for you to be here today. We are going to be going over step two of our one, two, three process. So if you already watched step one for Choose Your Cover, great job. You are in the right place. If you haven't seen that one yet, go back and watch it and then come back and rewatch step two. Today, we are going to be choosing your inserts. So um, here on Coordinate Your Chaos, I show you how I juggle three businesses, a blended family with six kids, a full-time job, and two kids in virtual school. You can find me right here on YouTube, so make sure you subscribe to my channel to see the latest and greatest from me and Tula12. I am Teresa Stone. I'm the Blended Mama, and I'm an independent brand ambassador with Tula12, and I'm here to help you coordinate your chaos. So again, we are gonna be going over the different inserts that you can choose. I cannot go over all of them. I'm really gonna just show you the best way to search for them. But if you are overwhelmed by the website, you can feel free to go to theblendedmama.net, fill out my personal shopper form, and I will work with you to find, help you find the system that's gonna work best for you. So if this all ends up just being too much, it shouldn't be, let me help you help yourself. Okay. So you can, again, fill out that personal shopper form and I will set up an appointment to just chat with you and work out what is going to work best for you. Okay. Um, if you want to go and look on for yourself, you can again, go to the blendedmama.net and click on the shopping link and it's going to take you to this website. Okay. So this is what it's going to look like. We are currently um, in April 2021, so that's you are seeing our brand new tie-dye release design. Um, but what we're going to do, again, we already have gone over choose a cover, okay? Today, we are going to choose your inserts. That is step two, okay? So you're going to click on the choose your inserts, and it's going to default by showing you inserts by type. I personally prefer to look for my inserts by lifestyle. So if you click on inserts by lifestyle, it is going to give you a bunch of different options. Ignore this over here. You're going to really just want to look at the list here on the left. So we have personal and family, small business, food and meal plan, student and teacher, direct sales business, health, wellness, and fitness, travel and vacation, a home planner, financial focused, goal focused, med medical planner, journaling, and faith focused. So this is how I'm going to recommend that you start looking for your inserts. It will give you a great idea of how to find the inserts that are going to work best for you without seeing all 100 plus inserts. Okay. That can absolutely be overwhelming and I don't want you to feel that way. So I strongly suggest that you look by lifestyle. You can also use the search tool that is up here at the top. If you just click on it, you can say, I want coloring. Okay, we do have coloring pages. Um, so if you are looking for coloring pages, you can just type in coloring and it will show you our mandala coloring pages and our spring coloring inserts. Okay, I do happen to have the coloring book and it is super cute. Look at these little cute owls. Okay, so coloring books are great for de-stressing or maybe you have kids that you need to keep busy in the car on your vacation. Um, these are fantastic for that. Okay, so that's how you're going to search for your inserts. I am going to show you just a couple of the ones that I have. I just showed you the coloring one. I am going to show you um, the clean house. Um, this is one that we are currently using. We are doing a spring cleaning challenge, but this insert is really more for ongoing cleaning. So it really lists all your rooms. You can write the different tasks. You can color code it if you do certain tasks on a specific day of the week or maybe a specific person in your household does them. You can absolutely organize them however you would like, um, but this will help you keep up with all the cleaning stuff that needs to happen that I know I don't like to do, okay? Um, but the other one that I'm really enjoying, this is what we're working through as a community in our chaos coordinator community is the spring cleaning. So it actually has a 31 day challenge, which we're doing in April. So there's only 30. So um, days 30 and 31 get bundled up together for us um, this month. But this is walking you through some of the bigger steps like cleaning out your master closets. I donated a, an entire bag of clothes that I can't tell you the last time I wore and they probably don't fit anymore. Thank you, COVID. Um, so 
it walks you through those bigger tasks. It walks you through cleaning out the baseboards, the windows, the blinds and the curtains, all those things that I don't remember to do on a weekly basis. So, I mean, uh, maybe you are better than I am, um, but I also make my kids clean. So um, this is stuff that I am working through to make sure they get done well. Um, and I love that insert. The other insert that we're going to be using next month in May is the meal and grocery. So um, I love this because it has a place for you to do your meal planning for the week on one side and make your grocery list on the other. So it's all in one book and you can keep up with everything all in one place. So I love that. And the last one I'm going to show you is our bills and budget. So a lot of people are working on reducing debt and getting their finances in order. This is a great insert to help you with that. So it has different items for keeping up with your bills and budget. And these come in all the sizes. So you can get them, you know, if you were trying to keep it in your wallet, you could get it in the small size. If you are have a whole separate one that is for your whole household. So maybe you include your bills and budget along with your spring cleaning and your clean house insert all in one organizer. That totally works. Okay. So that is how you're going to choose your inserts. There's usually an incentive if you're buying four more inserts to get jump bands for free. So these are jump bands. They allow you to expand your cover to use more than the number of bands that are in there. And I will go over how to use them in a separate video. Um, but that is the basics for selecting your inserts. Keep in mind what which cover you selected and how many inserts it will hold. So the small, the classic pro will hold um, four to eight. The class, sorry, the classic pro will hold two to four. The classic will hold four to eight. The um, trifolio and go holds maybe three. And um, the interchangeable will also hold a four to eight. Okay, so keep that in mind uh, whenever you are purchasing your inserts that you don't overwhelm your cover, okay? So if you have more questions, feel free to contact me. But until next time, coordinate that chaos.